Understanding, no favoritism in English. Hello, everyone. Today we're going to explore a very important phrase in English, no favoritism. This phrase is used in various contexts and it's crucial for English learners to understand its meaning and usage. Let's dive in and unravel the nuances of this phrase together. No favoritism refers to the practice of treating all people equally and not giving preferential treatment to anyone. It's often used in situations where fairness and impartiality are important, such as in workplaces, schools, or competitions. Understanding this phrase is essential as it reflects a key value in many cultures, the importance of equality and fairness. 1. Workplaces. In a professional setting, no favoritism ensures that all employees are treated equally, regardless of their relationship with the boss or colleagues. 2. Education. Teachers and educators use this phrase to signify that all students are given equal opportunities and evaluations. 3. Family dynamics. Sometimes used in family discussions, it means treating all family members equally without bias. 4. Law and governance. This phrase is crucial in legal and governmental contexts, signifying the impartiality expected in these areas. The manager insists on no favoritism. Every employee must follow the same rules. As a judge, I uphold no favoritism in my courtroom. Everyone is treated equally under the law. Our school's policy of no favoritism ensures that all students have the same chance to succeed. Understanding and using no favoritism correctly can help in communicating the principles of equality and impartiality. It's a phrase that carries significant moral and ethical weight, reflecting a commitment to fairness in various aspects of life. I hope this video has helped you understand the meaning and importance of the phrase, no favoritism, in English. Remember, using this phrase correctly can help convey a powerful message about equality and fairness in your communication. Thanks for watching, and keep learning!